Jim Hawkins is a young boy who lives in his parents' inn, the Admiral Benbow, near Bristol, England, in the 18th century. An old sea captain named Billy Bones dies in the inn after being presented with a black spot or official pr pirate verdict of guilt or judgment. Jim is stirred to action by the spot and its mysterious accurate portent of Billy's death. Hastily, Jim and his mother unlock Billy's sea chest, finding a logbook and map inside. Hearing steps outside, they leave with the documents before Billy's pursuers ransack the inn. Jimmy realizes that the contents of the contents he snatched from the sea chest must be valuable, so he takes one of the documents he has found to some local acquaintances, Dr. Levisey and Squire Trelawney. Excited, they recognize it as a map for a huge treasure that the infamous pirate Captain Flint has buried on a distant island. Trelawney immediately starts planning an expedition. Naive in his negotiations to outfit his ship, the Hispaniola, Trelawney is tricked into hiring one of Flint's former mates, Long John Silver, and many of Flint's crew. Only the captain, Smollett, is trustworthy. The ship sets sail for Treasure Island with nothing amiss, until Jim overhears Silver's plan for mutiny. Jim tells the captain about Silver and the rest of the rebellious crew. Landing at the island, Captain Smollett devises a plan to get most of the mutineers off the ship, allowing them leisure time on the shore. On a whim, Jim sneaks into the pirate's boat and goes ashore with them. Frightened of the pirates, Jim runs off alone. From a hiding place, he witnessed Silver's murder of a sailor who refuses to join the mutiny. Jim flees deeper into the heart of the island, where he encounters a half-crazed man named Ben Gunn. Ben had once served in... Flint's crew, but was marooned on the island years earlier. <laughs>